what's going down everybody welcome back to another episode of camping with coleman it's your boy josh aka coleman and as you can see here we have got a box we've got a fairly good sized box today i'm pretty stoked on this i uh, already removed my info off there this time i was actually paying attention i remembered to do it and we're just going to go ahead and dig into this man now i can tell you right now off the bat this is not going to be a long unboxing um, based on the fact, well, compared to the normal ones I do from Asia Tees, there's only two things in this box. That's it, two things. And uh, they need to descend it in this big box. So let's see what's in here. Let's see what's in here. Get all this off here. Um, how are we going to go about opening this today? I think we're going to go from the bottom right here. Boom. Like that, and there, 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 and there. All right, so that should allow us to rip this open at least. Yes. All right, so there's that. Boom. Now, on top, immediately, we've got like a big box inside of a big box and there's a little box so you know i don't want to show you what's in that little box just yet so let's go ahead and uh, pull this off here and get the big box out okay so here's the big box let's set this right there throw that aside and we'll just set this right up here this is that second box is in there and i don't want you guys to see what's in that just yet all right so what is in here what is in here? We're gonna take a look at this on the next episode. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna set that aside. We're gonna look at that on the next episode. So, this episode, we're gonna look at this box. This box right here is from Team Raff, Raffi, Team Raffi Co, I, uh, Team Raffi Company. I always mess up the name on this, um, but this is a pretty cool item that's in this. Now, I'm not sure how this opens. I'm trying to find the correct Okay, it looks like it's going to go like that, so we'll slide it a little bit. Yep, just like that. Let's just dig right into this. I don't want to really mess around. I don't want to get right to it. I want to see what's in here. These guys uh, are awesome. They've been really digging into the scale world lately. These guys have really been coming out with some cool stuff. I've got a whole bunch of products from them. Really cool stuff. And this is no exception, you guys. This is the Land Rover. Defender 110 pickup truck. Oh, yeah. Super stoked on this. I'm just I'm pulling everything out right here so you guys can see just how it is because it's all packed. Those are really heavy seats. It's all packaged up still. Let's just slide this whole body right out here so we can get rid of the box. Boom. There's also interior pieces in there. More seats. And we'll get rid of this box. And there we have it. Let's slide all this over. Look at this, man. Just, there's a lot of stuff with this body. Holy cow. So the whole point of this body, we're not going to get into all this right now. We're going to do another episode where we actually build this thing up um, and kind of go over it when it's all put together. But for now, uh, here is the base of the body. Man, that is like an overwhelming amount of packages inside of that. Wow. So here we have it. This is the base structure of the body. Okay, super, super slick, all right? They put some thought into this. They put some time into this. Okay, you can really, really swap things around. Um, basically, from my understanding, now this goes like this. Uh, if I wanted to, I might even be able to get the uh, other top and make this a full Land Rover. I'm, I'm not entirely sure on that, but I think that it's possible for me to get the second top and make this a, a or make this a full D110. Now, obviously, I'm not entirely sure on that. It's something I'd have to look into, but this is really, really cool, man. This is really cool. It's gonna, you know, I'm, I'm just curious. I don't really know what to expect. I had no plans of building a Land Rover another defender but this body came out and i was just like man i've got it i've got to have one of those i just need to have one of these 
So I got it, and now I gotta figure out what to do with it, you guys. So uh, we're gonna build this into something. I don't know. I'm thinking an Axial SCX102, basically bone stock underneath of this, um, but with just my front motor conversion, and that's it. It, and then just leave the rest stock and see how it does. Now, I'm not sure if the wheelbase would line up. I have an Axial SCX-10 too, but it's already been modified, so it doesn't have the same wheelbase anymore. So it's not a good way for me to find out. Um, what I'll have to do is take some measurements and just do some research and see what I can make happen with this. I've got a good feeling about it, though. I think something really cool could come from this. Um, Yes, I'm super stoked. And it's got a lot of stuff here. I mean, we've got every component. Here's the front uh window part here here's your doors all four doors um here's your hood we've got a hood for it obviously you've got front and rear seats which are really heavy i'm not so sure why the seats are so heavy i mean these feel like they're actually solid that's really crazy that they're so heavy it's almost like solid rubber or something um here's the rear seats here Super detailed, and like I said, we'll, we'll unbox all these later and go through it in a more detailed fashion. Uh, here's all your door panels. I mean, I'm just stoked, and most importantly, right here, here's the floor pan. The floor pan's important, that's awesome. So, yeah, I, I'm gonna, I'm just stoked. I'm gonna put this in a box for now, I'm just gonna put it back in the box and put it away, and then once I get another SEX 10 2 or something like that, where I can really work with it we'll start diving into this you guys but for now just know that i've got it here and because they go fast so get yours pick it up from asia tees right now www.asiatees.com they've got the link is always in the description they've got these in stock i believe but they're going really fast so go ahead and pick one up if you can that's why i got mine now even though i'm not prepared to do the build i just wanted to have it here that way i i wouldn't have to worry later about trying to source one out so anyways you guys thank you very much for tuning in i'm gonna go ahead and get up off here try to package all this back up i'm stoked i am super stoked thank you for watching i'm gonna see you on the next episode peace and chicken grease everybody yeah <laughs>